Hi there, my name is Ryan and I love riding my bike. I love it so much that this past fall I jumped on my trusty Doozer Cruiser and rode it from Vancouver to Cabo San Lucas. And I brought my little brother Ethan along because it's no fun to have an adventure on your own. Are you ready to go? I'm ready. Alright, let's get our helmets. I picked this route because I was told that the coastal highway passed through some of the most beautiful scenery on the planet, and from day one, I was blown away. So some highways are lined with trash. This highway is lined with fresh blackberries. Free food right here. Um. My favorite place had to be Cannon Beach in Oregon. Man, this place is breathtaking. No, actually, my favorite place for sure was riding through the redwoods of Northern California. These gentle giants are 300 feet tall and up to 2,000 years old. I can see now why the Ewoks love this place so much. Ethan is 6'3", that tree is just a little bit taller. Man, that's huge. Every day I saw something more beautiful than the last, and when I got to Big Sur, I had a new favorite spot. I thought beauty like this only existed in movies. This is the perfect end to an epic day. This is the best campsite by far. I am right on the edge of a cliff. I can hear the waves. The sun is setting. Oh man, I'm a lucky boy. This is so awesome. But I guess it can't all be beautiful. And as I made my way down the coast, I can tell you with 100% certainty that LA is definitely not the most beautiful part of the Pacific Coast. But once I crossed south of the border, everything changed. It was like I had the whole place to myself. It's really quiet out here. Not much going on. And I gotta say, the deserty landscape in Baja made me feel like I was on another planet. <laughs> Woo! Oh, life is beautiful. I saw endless amounts of incredible nature on my 3,000 mile journey. It's hard to pick my favorite spot. So I'll just end this by saying that we live in a beautiful world and I was super lucky to see it from the seat of my bicycle.